Hello guys, welcome back. So finally we have received a new update in the Warzone mobile. Let's go through all the updates and I'm gonna tell you whether its update is good or bad and what all changes you can expect. First off, let's talk about the graphics. Now they have made some adjustment to help your device stream asset more efficiently so you can experience stunning visuals without a lag. What a joke. So now they have also fixed the bug where the streaming indicator was not appearing for few devices but right now you can see the streaming indicator. Now for those who don't know what is exactly the streaming indicator is that if you download the game for the first time it will just show you something that's streaming the progress or streaming the graphics or asset just wait a few minutes. That's all. So for the next update is coming for the iPhone users. So those who are using iPhone 12 Pro and Pro Max players out there, they have optimized their default graphic settings to keep their phone cool during the intense matches only for the iPhones. I don't know what to comment about this. So these were the few graphical improvement that you can see on the hotfix update right now. Now let's just talk about the gameplay improvement or gameplay updates they have put in this. So they have fixed a bug that caused SA killstreak explosion to clip through the objects. Now they have also ensured that your favorite camos are displaying correctly on your season 3 legendary weapons. Now speaking of the weapons, they also have addressed a balance issue with the NCPR 300 making sure that every gunfight is fair and play. They have just adjusted it a little bit. Now they have also removed the survivor perk from NPC loadout so you don't have to worry about those perk right now. The next minor fixes was that the select game mode menu was not remembering your preferences. But that's not all. They have also identified and fixed some crashes issue for Pixel 6 and Samsung Galaxy S21 users. And also they have made sure that the double kills are registering properly in multiplayer mode making those multi kills even more satisfying. Now they have also fine tuned the weapon loot spawns and rarity tables and adjusted the availability of weapons in the gulag to keep things fresh and exciting. Last but not the least, they have also improved the matchmaking timing that means they have added some kind of implemented a new adjustment rule or matching rule we don't know but it claims that we will be getting matchmaking faster than the usually we used to receive from the previous update. The next was the plus the mode select menu is now feature images and time limit for each mode so now you can make informed decision in a flash uh, blah 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 they are just showing you images and time limit what all time limits are there in the select mode menu not a big deal that's all but stitna hi bhai bas khatam bhai so that's all that's the 3.4.2 hotfixes packed with optimization buff fixes and gameplay adjustment to make sure you get a best possible experiences and we don't know the ground reality right now so now let's talk about the ground reality. So I just played this game and I haven't opened the game right now. I haven't tested any of the matches. I just click on my Warzone Mobile application. So as soon as I click on my application, it just log in. I just downloaded that and I just waited for 5 to 4 minutes in the lobby. And what you can expect, my device was heating like a hell. I can just toast a bad bread on it. Just a satire for you. Don't get controversy on this time. And you can see that the data usage was so much of heavy. So I don't think so this update will do something for Android user. But yes, I have also seen receive some kind of community updates, Twitter that people are telling that yeah, their game just got a little bit of better, not the best, just a pinch of it. So that's the ground reality right now. So if you are thinking of giving it a try, I would suggest yes, you can go and give it a try but on your own risk if you have Android. But I would say the garmi bohat zada hi bar rahi hai bhai. अगर आप इंडिया से हो तो बट इतनी ज़्यादा गर्मी है कि भाई तुम अगर मोबाइल में खेलोगे तो ये 40 से 50 डिग्री पहुंच जाएगा और आपका डिवाइस टोस्ट बन सकता है। So for that reason, I would say just don't try it right now. Let's just wait for them to fully optimize this game for the Android person and do not invest any kind of thing. And a small request to my subscribers, if you are watching this video till right now, so I just want your feedback according my voice, my editing, whatever. If you don't like it, please try and comment down below. Or bhaiyo, Indian, aap bata sakte ho mujhe. Koi sharmani ki zarurat nahi hai. Main apni cheez ko improvement karna chahta hu. Aapko long form video kaisi pasand hai? Thoda sa zada ho raha hai, ab kam ho raha hai. Wo mujhe feedback comment section mein bata do. To theek hai bhai, chalo bhai, milte hai, bye bye, see you.